Hey rock stars, Lou Lombardi back at you. Hey guys, I want to talk to you guys today about when things feel like they're going completely off the rails, when you feel like it's completely out of control, where you're sitting back and going like, how the heck did I end up here, okay? Uh, you may have been, you may be familiar with this idea of the butterfly effect, okay? And just to paraphrase, the butterfly effect says that a butterfly flaps its wings somewhere over in China, and halfway around the world we get a hurricane. And all that this means <clears throat> is that little tiny changes end up causing sometimes big problems or big changes down the road. So, so, so it's a sort of like fanning out effect. Some little thing happens back here and it sort of fans out and there's infinite possibilities and just, uh, different pro probabilities interacting with other probabilities and this is the place we end up at down the road, okay? And who knows why you're overwhelmed? Who knows what circumstances have led to this point where you feel like everything is a mess, okay? And this happens once in a while. This happens to me once in a while. In fact, I'm kind of going through this right now. Um, things feel a little out of control. Feel, things feel like a little overwhelming. There's only one thing you, well, there's, there's several things you can do, but the first thing you need to do when this happens, the first thing I need to do when this happens, we all need to do, is to just stop. Okay, first of all, take, take, just accept where you are, okay? I'm feeling overwhelmed, I'm feeling like it's out of control, I feel like I don't, I feel like there's so much going on, I don't even know what to do first, and accept that feeling. Be with that feeling. Then go back to your inner experience, okay? Get back inside, calm down, or as they say in Pittsburgh, calm down, okay? Relax, maybe, maybe do whatever you have to do. Take a step back. Close your eyes for a little bit, meditate, maybe take a 15 minute nap, do something to kind of re-equalize yourself internally. Return to your inner experience, okay? Return to all the good things that you are talking about within yourself. Return to a positive inner, inner dialogue. But the first thing you have to do is accept where you are, then you can start to kind of modify your internal experience. Once you start to modify your internal experience, I promise, <clears throat> That the outside stuff will all of a sudden not look so bad. You will now have perspective and you'll be in a better position to kind of like attack things or to kind of put, pull things back together or to maybe you even realize, oh, wait a minute, it really isn't all that bad. All I got to do is this, this, and this and I'll get that taken care of like real quick and I can call this person and they can help me with that. You'll have the perspective and you'll have the sort of uh, energy, you'll have the sort of uh, control over your emotions that re really requires to get you out of this situation and to where you want to be. <clears throat> Giant no-no. Do not resist the situation. Do not resist your internal feelings over the situation. So if you are feeling overwhelmed, you are feeling pissed off, you feel like you want to throw a chair, don't throw a chair, but acknowledge that and accept that and be with that. Allow that to kind of go through you, okay? Most people are very afraid of that. Most people, uh, you know, who are, uh, are working with these kinds of programs feel like they immediately need to find something positive or do something positive. That is absolutely the wrong way to go. There's an old expression, what you resist will persist. So when you have this feeling of overwhelm, like, oh my God, oh, what, oh, I don't know what to do first, I'm completely freaking out here, accept that feeling, return to, then return to your inner experience. Then when you come out of your inner experience, then you will start to get some perspective on how to handle things. At that point, look at your plan. Look at what your overall idea of where you want to go and how you're going to do it is going to be. Which things are going to take you to where you want to go? Which things are holding you back? What things can be put off to uh, you know another day or next week? And what things do you think you need to take care of right now? Then you're in a better position to make those kind of decisions. Do not resist. Accept. Embrace. Then go to your inner experience. <clears throat> Work on your inner experience. Come out of that refreshed. And then you'll be in a much better position. Okay, guys. My name is Lou Lombardi. Thanks so much for watching. Please check out the links below and I will see you guys in the next video.